Hi there! Welcome to Palette University and a really quick tutorial about how to get an item that I haven't seen people really talking about at all uh, in Pokemon Sword and Shield. So if you like Pokemon Sh uh, Sword and Shield content, uh, feel free to like and or subscribe. We make mostly Pokemon Science, Pokemon Theory type content, uh, as that's where I'm sort of personally an expert. I go to graduate school for paleontology, so talking about science is kind of what I do for a living. So uh, here we're going to be talking about an item that I haven't seen anyone else cover. So first you're going to want to uh, fast travel or ride your bike or whatever to, I never know how to say this town's name, Sir Chester? I know people in Britain say, like, towns that end in Chester differently, like Sir Chester, something to that effect. Anyway, go to the ice town, and you're going to want to go to the left-hand side of the Hotel Ionia, and you're going to want to go up the elevator, no, that's on this side, you're going to want to go up the elevator to the second floor. So what this item does is it allows you to catch Pokemon easier. It's a charm, similar to how there's the oval charm to hatch eggs faster and the shiny charm to hatch, or uh, to get shiny Pokemon uh, more, so you have more shiny rerolls. This, uh, I'll show you in my bag right now, because I already got it. Uh, it is the catching charm. Uh, holding it is said to increase the chance of getting a critical catch. Curiously, the charm doesn't shake much. So basically, it makes it easier to get a critical catch therefore making it easier to uh, catch Pokemon. And there's no uh, prerequisite for, this, for prerequisite for getting this. You don't have to uh, become the champion. You don't have to be a certain number of gyms. As soon as you get to this town, you can come here and talk to this guy here. And he will give you uh, this catching charm. Uh, based on this, this text here, uh, it is quite the task to complete a Pokedex, but I hope you won't give up. If you do manage to complete yours, come and show it to me. I'm assuming this is where you also get the shiny charm, which I have not been able to do yet. Um, there's a number of people in this, in this, uh, this is like the typical, uh, room in the game that has, like, a couple people, like, on the dev team, basically, how there's, like, the game director somewhere. I think, um, this woman here is playing Pokemon Go. This guy made the music, I guess. And this guy's a planner, so... Um, just the typical room that's in pretty much every Pokemon game. Um, I think even going back to Red and Blue, uh, they had this. So, uh, just a really quick tutorial about how to catch Pokemon easier. It can, you know, even that small extra critical catch chance can mean a lot when you're talking about, uh, catching stuff like, uh, some of the Gigantamax, uh, raid battles in the, uh, in the wild area. Especially for, like I said, those more rare ones, such as all of the Gigantamax Pokemon forms because it really sucks when you have to either miss out on it because you didn't save beforehand, or uh, have to keep redoing it and start like uh, rebooting your game until you finally catch it. So every little bit helps. So hopefully you uh, appreciated this guide. Like I said, uh, we make mostly Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield, or Pokemon in general, science theory type content. Uh, if you like that kind of thing, feel free to subscribe. Uh, follow us on Twitter at palette underscore you. And uh, if you feel that we're worthy of it, uh, check us out on Patreon down at the link below. And as always, there's a time and place for everything.